This is episode 1569. Welcome to the Daily Meditation Podcast. I'm Mary Meckley here, and I'm so happy that you are doing this for yourself. This is a pretty amazing thing that you are doing for yourself. Meditation is hands down scientific article after scientific article, as well as 5,000 years of history showing the benefits of meditation in just about all areas of your life. So, this week, all week long, we have been exploring the topic of fatigue, managing fatigue, And you've discovered that sometimes when you take it easy, not to where you're doing nothing, because that can actually cause fatigue, as we've explored in this series, but rather when you're really focused and you're doing things that are in alignment with your values, this is nourishing. You could work all day long this way, feeling aligned, feeling vibrant, and not feeling fatigued at all, because you actually feel energized by what you're doing. So really, as we've explored throughout this series, managing fatigue is all about honoring yourself and who you are. It's exhausting trying to be someone we're not, or living on someone else's agenda. So when you get back to yourself, which meditation helps you to do, you can begin to feel that sense of renewal and clarity about how you live your life. So in today's episode, I want to share with you as well and herb. Herbs can benefit you in a similar way as do meditation techniques. This is an herb that you might not be so familiar with unless you live in India or follow Ayurvedic medicine. If you live in the West, chances are you're not quite as familiar with the herb go to cola. You might consider As you're at the very tail end of this series, we have one more episode after today, rewarding yourself by trying an herb that you've never tried before. Go to Cola. Let me tell you what it does for you. Now, you always want to make sure that any herb you take is not going to harm you. So check with your physician, especially if you take medications or are pregnant or breastfeeding. I always say this because it's that important. Herbs are powerful, but don't be afraid of them. Just respect them. So go to cola is an herb that helps you manage fatigue. And it's also an herb that studies show can benefit your mental clarity as well as to help with Alzheimer's disease and dementia. It's also an herb that benefits heart health and circulation. So this sounds like an herb that may be beneficial. Now we are offering herbs now on our website, Sip and Ohm. In fact, we're offering a subscription herbal tea box that you can receive each month and the herbs are customized for each week's series. So you can try that out at sipandom.com. You also know, as I mentioned, always because you might want a little more meditation support. And I offer the full half hour guided meditations over on the Sip and Om meditation app. We have the Android and iOS version for you. So you can receive a daily meditation. You don't have to meditate for the full half hour. 
You can break off at any point you want. You get a journal as well as a slow down guide with the meditation techniques on it. Now you get full access to the entire app, not just a sample. You get access to the full app for two weeks free. This is a special promotion. So we have the Android and iOS versions, the Sip and O meditation app, and check out our teas as well. You can do that on the app too. So settle yourself down and let's combine some of the techniques you've explored in this week's series and layer them into one meditation. This is how I meditate. I layer techniques. The techniques, as always, help you transition from your busy day, whatever you were doing, you settle yourself down, and then you do a few techniques to help relax your mind and body. And then this allows you to go into that inner stillness. We covet when we meditate. Sitting up straight, relaxing your body. Your eyes are uplifted to the point between your eyebrows. Inhale a nice deep inhale through your nose. And as you exhale, exhale through your mouth. And feel that cool air escape. And visualize yourself blowing out or cooling down tension or inflamed emotions that may cause you fatigue. Think about your week. What has caused you fatigue? Take another nice deep inhale through your nose. Visualizing a soft, glowing fire burning at your abdomen, your third chakra. And as you exhale, exhale through your nose, feeling the cool air calming down those inflamed emotions that wipe out your energy. Cool them down with your breath. Now mentally repeat to yourself, I am worth slowing down for. Beautiful. Now sink into stillness. You are so worth slowing down for. 